how to collaborate on OWASP SAM assessments with SAMI. SAMI is per definition a collaboration tool. Tasks can be assigned to different team members and uh, the flow can pass from one team member to the next. Here I am on my dashboard and here are the current tasks that need to be done. I have one task in the evaluation track and 28 tasks in the improvement track. That is for this specific scope. If I go to a different scope, I will have, for example, the scope hasn't been started yet. I will have 30 uh, evaluations that need to be done. Now, if I want to add people, to assign people to tasks, I need to first of all make sure that they are in my organization. And secondly, they need to be in a team that has access to this uh, scope. So first thing first, the users you find under manage users. There you can add users to uh, the organization. I add name, surname, email address. On this email address, they will receive the invite. And then the roles. If you wonder about the roles, you can hover over the question mark. A team manager is somebody who can invite other people and manage other people. A manager is somebody who can do everything, a validator, improver, evaluator, and so on. And um, the other things, well, quite intuitively, they have that role. They have a validator role, evaluator, or improver role, or a combination of several of these. You can select multiple of these if you want to. An external assessor is maybe a consultant that is doing assessments for you, and their uh, scores are automatically validated as they are also the validator. And then I need to assign them to teams. I need to fill everything out, of course, but I'm not going to do that right now. But I'm going to go to team and I'm going to show the teams. We have currently have two teams and each team has access to different business units and different scopes. Um, I can manage that here by clicking on the scopes. So this, this one has access to everything and this team has access only to acti some activities of business unit two. I could add another team here. Uh, sec team three. And when I create it, it does not have access to anything, but then I can manage the scopes for this team and I can give it access to everything, for example. Um, now, when I go to my users, I can check which users have access to uh, which teams. So if I go to the information of this user, for example, uh, Nicolas, he's on team Dagflasche, but he's not on SEC team three and he's not on AppSec team two. So he will have access to the uh, scopes that uh, Dagflasche's team has access to. That is the essentials of how you manage uh, teams and users. Now, if I have done that correctly, I should be able to assign tasks to different users within this uh, team in order to have different people fill out different uh, parts of the assessment or to the different parts of the improvements. I can also bulk assign a series of assign uh, tasks to the same to the person who's responsible for that. And thus um, the roles and the tasks are distributed across users and teams within uh, SAMI.